Hello, my name is Abdul Karim Sesnaika and I'm from Three Mountains Learning Advisors. And my name is Gerry van der Huls, I'm also from Three Mountains Learning Advisors. For me, um, as I like ICT, so I want to be in um, ICT things, but also, but also to to explore and uh, to have uh, skills and things that I need so that I can contribute something to my e-learning field. That's why. Okay. Perfect. Okay. And as a company, as Three Mountains Learning Advisors, we have started the Soft Skills Academy. So there's online learning and then there's face-to-face -face, uh, teaching or online teaching. We have a booth and we're here to look for as many partners as possible. And maybe Alison is a possible partner to share our courses with. For me, uh, the future of e-learning is developing. As we can see now, we we are in uh, e-learning Africa and somehow it is too big than the last year, which means that uh, it is improving. And also, if I can say, uh, we are throwing papers away. So <laughs> maybe uh, in the next uh, few years, things will go digitally, you know, full, full digitally. And uh, I think for all people can can try to like it and try to contribute something to it. And I think one of the great challenges for Africa is content, uh, content that's local, because many e-learning is made United States, I don't know where, and often there's an issue with it's like not me if it's Africa. And the other issue is connectivity. Like we are now in Rwanda, we are in the capital, it seems very nice, but in reality in rural areas people are still not connected, don't have enough command of English and are not able to follow. So the digital divide, like the haves and the have not, that is a big issue, I think. For me, if I'm going to say about the, uh, Alison, I don't know much about Alison, but I think it's very good company for me. <laughs> okay, and I think... Um, I look briefly at the courses and it has the problem of not me. There's no Africa section. So it's about like relating right. to the to the to the content. So I'd advise you to start like special section for Africa with local content. Right.